Sam is on the line in New York City. Sam, welcome to the Ramsey Show. Hey, guys. What's going on? Hey, how are you? How can we help? I'm doing good. Uh, basically, my dilemma is this. I'm a senior in college, and um, uh, I'm majoring in business management. They instituted a vaccine mandate, and uh, they, re- they denied my religious exemption request. So where I'm at is, you know, I don't graduate. I was ready to graduate in May. So where I'm at is now I transfer to a, get a random online degree. You know, I feel like that's going to affect me down the, down the road. What do you guys think? Okay, so it's in business management is what your degree's in? Right. Okay, where, uh, well, tell me this. What is your concern about the online, just the fact that it's online, that it doesn't have some type of reputation like the, the school you went to, or is it this specific online school yeah. that you're not as believing in as much? Well, yeah, it just, I mean, I put in, I already invested so many years and so much money to get this degree from, you know, and now to just go online I just feel like it's not it's not the same, or am I overreacting? Well, I, I just want to say I'm sorry that happened. Um, I'm sorry you have put in the time, and now you're finishing out in a way that you didn't want to. And I'm sorry because that's that. There's a little bit of 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 loss there to grief, you know. Like I thought it was going to go this way, and it didn't. And um, and I hear that. Here's what I'll say, Sam, on my side of things of working for this organization. We hire a ton of people. I'm a certified business coach. I have hired plenty of people in my life. Um, what people are looking for has so much more to do with who you are, how you interview, the skills that you have the experience that you have, then the title on your degree. I know you're disappointed. And I just want to say that's valid. I, I, I can't, you know, I can't blame you there just because you didn't think it was going to go this way. I don't think it's going to keep you from getting the job that you want. I think what's going to get you the job that you want is you. I think experience, networking, doing what Ken Coleman teaches, getting around the people that are doing what you want to do, getting an internship this year, getting your foot in the door, building relationships, getting some experience, solving problems, showing your skills, developing your skills, helping people. That's what's going to get at your job. That's what's going to get you promotions, not a degree. You're disappointed, and I get that, but I just want to encourage you. I don't think that that's going to hold you back. Um, I don't think that that's what was going to get you the job before, and I don't think it's going to keep you from getting the job now. I don't know. George, what do you think? Yeah. I, I think well, it comes out of the person. Yeah, I've got questions about your do your credits transfer. I mean, how much are you losing here when it comes to education? So I was going to graduate in May. If I transfer, I have another year and a half left, it looks like. Oh, on I top of that. I didn't realize that. I thought it was the same track record. Yeah, you're so finishing you're, you're, you are losing a good chunk of time by switching to the online Why? degree. Why? Why? They don't. They don't actually offer any online. It would be a different school. Right, but I'm saying, can you find us? I, I was a transfer student. I transferred from the University of Central Florida to University of Tennessee Knoxville after a year and a half, and all but like four credits transferred. I found the school I wanted to go to. That was an in-state school to get in-state tuition. Can you find an online school that will accept the majority of your credits, where you're only having to finish out, and maybe there's a couple that don't transfer? That's my question. Got it. Yeah. So a part of it is because I spent a year abroad. So the school I'm in counted that for credit, but a lot of these online um, schools uh-huh. aren't counting that towards credit my year abroad that I spent. And the school isn't uh, willing to let you finish out online? Is there a way to do that? No. No, no they won't. Interesting. What school is this? Sison School of Business. Okay. Well, I would do I would do some more research and dig into it. I don't want you to just make this jump without having all of the information possible. So now that you're going online, I mean, the world is your oyster. Yeah. You can you can do any program and a lot of these online programs are actually really good now. You don't have to go with like a sketchy online university. You can find a lot of accredited universities online with online programs. So I would call up every single one that is an option that you can cash flow and figure out who's going to take the most credits so that you spend the least amount of money and the least amount of time to finish out this degree. Yeah, I didn't understand that Sam about adding so much time to your education. I totally agree. I don't I don't want you to do that either. I'm uh taking online classes right now through Fuller um, uh, seminary classes. And I chose that to your point, George, because I could choose any school I wanted to because it's online. I was able to choose the one that had the classes I wanted, the program I wanted. So Sam, I think it might just take some more research and digging to find a school that's a better fit for your specific program that might accept those study abroad credits um, that you can customize and, and have less time. Yeah, less time. Don't add on all these 
semesters if you don't have to in the cost. Yeah, yeah. I, I agree. I, th I think there's more out there. I just think you might have to do some digging to find it. And I think it'll be worth it if you do. Sam, can you cash flow this experience regardless? Yeah. Okay. Well, that's good. That's a, that's a big up right there. So I think you need to do some research. And like Christy said, Sam is the determining factor here, not the degree. The question is, are you good at business management? And uh, get your feet in the door somewhere. I mean, I started here as an intern, and my degree really was was not a huge part of that discussion. I started here as a project manager. So you and I both have stories of starting out, doing what we could, where we were. Yeah. Yep. Start uh, with where you are, with what you got, Sam. You got this, man. This is The Ramsey Show.